Hi everyone! Welcome to Olive Oil IELTS. I'm Olive, your friend to help you master IELTS. This is a lot of in the world. Okay. So the most frequent questions I get asked about speaking is how can I stop making mistakes in speaking? I think before to learn how, we should find out why first. I think the biggest issue about Chinese people speaking English is that when we speak English, we actually think in Chinese. And here comes all the problems. The first problem is um, it takes time for us to translate our Chinese ideas into English. Um, that means when we are having a conversation, I say something and I expect you to answer immediately. Instead, you take 30 seconds or even one minute to think about how to translate your Chinese ideas into English and organize all your sentences before you get back to me. Just imagine how weird and how difficult a conversation will be if that happens every little while. And the second problem is um, in the process of uh, trying to find the suitable and uh, appropriate words, you might find inappropriate words in different contexts. You can you up, no can no BB. Th you think too beautiful, you know, that sort of things, that sort of chain English. And the third problem is um, uh, obviously Chinese and English are two different languages, so they have different vocabularies sentence structures, tenses, grammars. Um, to be more specific, in Chinese, we don't have singular or plural forms for nouns. And that is 一个苹果, The 苹果 is always going to be the same. Whereas in English, an apple, two apples, three apples. The nouns are changing, depends on the amount of the nouns we want to describe. And another example is the tenses. For example, in Chinese, 昨天我去购物了. 昨天, the time is the only emphasis we put on uh, the tenses in Chinese. Whereas in English, yesterday, I went for shopping. Not only the time yesterday, but also the, 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 the verb also changed um, in different tenses. So, if we continue to think in Chinese when we speak English. Those little mistakes are almost inevitable. I passed along.